Good morning, good day, good afternoon. Welcome back to the channel. It's uh, another lovely, beautiful, sunny day in Eastern North Carolina here. And today I'm gonna to be working out in the vegetable garden. What pray tell am I gonna do in the vegetable garden today, you may be asking yourself. Well, I may have another bed coming in from Amazon that I will hopefully build and fill today. We'll see. I need, I have tomatoes and cucumbers that really need to get planted. And then perhaps I'm going to build another or set up another no dig bed. I have watermelon that needs to be planted, corn that needs to be planted. Yeah, and then, uh, but I think I'm gonna start with putting up some fence posts because, well, I have no fence. And I really, really, really wanna get this fencing project done. It's not gonna get done today, but I think I can get some of it done today. I'm gonna get cracking on that and uh, grab yourself a cup of tea, coffee, beverage choice, and uh, hang on to your hats. Another section of the fence done. Still gates to do, and the sun's coming in and out, and I have to do. Gates are another problem. I think next I'm going to work on the uh, in-ground bed, and then the raised bed, and then we'll get to planting. Okay, I don't know where we left off because, well, the video cut. But as you saw, I was putting down the cardboard and I'm putting down the uh, compost on top of that. I need a lot more compost. If I remember correctly, it's approximately 20 bags that I do uh, for the four foot by 20 foot uh, section that I did, just like I did over here. This won't get done today. I won't be able to plant my corn or melons today. I'm actually thinking just doing the whole four foot well, the whole 20 foot run with corn. Maybe two or three rows, I don't know. I have to do some investigation on that. If the audio is a little whacked, I apologize. I'm using a camera attached, I'm using a microphone attached to the camera and it doesn't pick up the, well, it, it does a good enough job but I'm standing a distance away and it picks up all the other ambient noise. Normally I would use a lapel mic but I'm very busy doing the fencing and then, then this and then the running around. But now we're gonna do a raised bed and then we're gonna fill the raised bed and then we're gonna plant the raised bed because I have stuff that needs to go in. There's cucumbers that have been sitting in seed starting mix too long and they're all trying to flower because they're all trying to grow and they're trying to produce, I gotta get them in the ground. So what are we waiting for? That bed is pine, not cedar. It is heat treated, so that's good. We'll see how long it lasts. Does it last the season? Does it last two seasons? It doesn't matter. I gotta get stuff planted. On with that.
Okay, as you can see, I got a little bit of a head start on you guys. Apologize. This is the cucumber trellis, so I'm gonna do four cucumber plants here. I have more than that, but I don't want to, maybe I will do more than that. I don't know. I'll get my cucumbers, I'll start planting. I'm gonna to try to plant other companion planting with that as well. I have to look up into that because I wanna maximize the space of the bed. I also have tomatoes, which I'm gonna plant out. So they'll go in the back over, back over here. So why am I talking about any of this? Let's get to planting. Okay, I'm done. Seriously, I'm done. Been at this since 10.30 this morning. It's now five o'clock. I did fencing. I started building a new in-ground bed, or on-ground bed, or no-dig bed, whatever you want to call it. And I built a new raised bed, and I started filling it with tomatoes that needed to go into the ground. Rutgers tomatoes, Bing cherry tomatoes. I have green finger cucumbers. I planted all six that I had. Hopefully it'll grow up to trellis. Uh, I took some dill that I had in pots. I dropped that into the uh, bed as well, along with some basil. So the basil is supposed to help keep the deer away, allegedly. We'll see about that. Plus it's always good in pests though, right? Uh, the bed behind it, I don't know if I ever mentioned, I have uh, on deck hybrid corn. Gets to about five foot tall. I might've mentioned that in a previous video and I have peas, and I have some climbing beans, and I have the loofah, and I've got oregano, and I've got cherry. In the bed beyond that, I have onion, basil, tomatoes, mortgage lifter, and early girl in that one. In these four beds right here, I have potatoes of all sorts of kinds. I've got, uh, oh, and I have some basil intermixed, again, to try to keep the deer away, plus who doesn't like pesto? So I have uh, Yukon Golds, I have Elba's, I have Oh, what is uh, oh. red Pontiac potatoes? More Yukon. I have Yukon gem potatoes. I have French fingerling potatoes. I've got more potatoes than I know what to do with. So busy day. One more bed to complete the dream of this space. I've been fighting with Lowe's to try to get some wood that I had ordered delivered. They claim it was delivered. It's not delivered because it's not here in the bed in the in the on the ground. We're on the video. Lowe's, if you ever stumble across this video, yeah, your delivery service is a little lacking. Just, just a little lacking. Just, just a little. But yeah, I still have that back fence to do, and I have four gates to build. That's gonna be a project for another day. That's it for today. If you, don't, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. There's all sorts of content coming up. I just don't do vegetable planting. I do flower planting. I'm going I want to grow it all. Whatever, if I can grow it, I want to grow it. I've got pumpkin I'm trying to grow. I've never tried to grow pumpkin before. Dahlias that I love that are growing in the front of the, uh, behind you, on the, uh, in front of the vegetable garden. I've got rose bushes that will be going into a rose garden soon. They're currently on the deck to try to keep them away from deer, because apparently deer like roses too, if they get hungry enough. I don't know. So this is what I've read on the interwebs. I guess you don't should believe or shouldn't believe everything you read on the interwebs. Either way, there's so much going on here. There are trees that will eventually be planted out in an orchard. There's going to be a, a flower garden that will be built. So if you haven't subscribed, why not? I'm, I'm growing a garden here in eastern North Carolina. I am, I am facing all sorts of challenges from weather to supplies to, to you name it. The, the sun, the sun is trying to kill me. There are these black flies which are trying to eat me alive. It's horrendous. But I'm trying. I'm going to try to grow this mag 
huge acre and a half garden. So if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Tell your friends, family, neighbors, grumpy old guy across the street. So if you'd like to help support the channel, I now have some merch. There's links below if you want to, if you care. So uh, t-shirts, mugs, things that I think that, you know, people will find useful uh, or like. Uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. Instagram, if you don't follow me on Instagram, please follow me on Instagram. I post the pictures there that I don't, don't, do not often post here on YouTube. I try to keep the content on Instagram different from what you see here on YouTube. So this way you kind of keep it fresh, see what's going on. Because who wants to look at a YouTube video and then jump over to Instagram and see the same thing? No one. No one. Or look at Instagram, jump over to YouTube and see the same thing. I don't want to see that. Come on. So I want to see something different. So there's going to be sorts of different stuff. It's only May. I've done quite a bit. There's a lot more to go. This project, this, my, this is going to take years to build. Years. So again, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Click the bell icon below to be notified of when there's another, another fly trying to eat me alive. If anything, subscribe to see if the flies actually eventually get me. That, that, that should be interesting. Yeah, I think I'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.